Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. We've got another Buff Bunny haul. I'm Jess and I'm obsessed with activewear. So if you love activewear too, definitely hit that subscribe button and also turn on those notifications so you don't miss any future videos. I'm really excited. I got some items from the Buff Bunny Deadlift Collection. Usually Halloween time, it's like one of their best launches. And this one was so fun. I did not get, there were some pleather pieces that were amazing. I did not get like the really over the top ones because I know myself, I have the holographic from last year or even the year before. I don't really wear them that much. So I tried to go with the practical ones, but they're still super fun. So let's dig in. I have not even opened the package. You know, I like to wait so we can do it together. I'm peeking in. I'm so excited. I have two sets, two sets. We had to be reasonable here. I do regret. Okay, they're not even doing stickers anymore, I don't think. No. Oh, wait, no, there is one. Okay. There is the deadlift sticker. Okay, because I did not get one with my grounds, which was really upsetting. Because I was like, let me do the sticker test. And then I didn't have it. Okay, so I got a set from the Material Girl line, which is one of my favorite lines. I have the original Material Girl leggings in several colors because I love them so much, green, brown, and black. They came out with some cross waist. So it is a ribbed fabric. If you're not familiar with the fabric, it's ribbed. So really great if you're someone that like wants to hide any sort of little imperfections, this will like skim right over it. I went with large. I actually have my other ones in medium, but I'm more of a large girl these days and I'm embracing it. So it has the cross waist, which is supposed to be extremely flattering. I watched a video where one girl was like more short waisted and this made her look like so snatched hourglass. So let's hope it can do that for me. Just a normal legging on the leg, nothing crazy. I'm still kind of regretting not getting normal leggings for the Heather Dream, but whatever. The back has kind of their signature V style. The logo is a lot better on these, it's embroidered. The other ones that I have, it's like a gold disc and I don't even know if it's like still on, on all of them. But yeah, just like a nice red, this color is called Venom. So like a nice deep red that I thought was so beautiful. And then the matching bra, it's really interesting. It has like a notch front. So this I felt like was different from things that I already have. It's like a little notch front. It actually has like a little bit of boning in there to keep it how it is. And then the back just has like little straps with little adjusters. So this just, I don't know, it just really got me. I just thought it was so cute. Um, and then there's removable cup pads. So I am extremely excited for this set because I already know that I love the Material Girl. Um, I have another, the other bra that I have from them, it goes like a little like cross, let's see. Let's see, one moment. Here's the other set. This is one of my favorite sets. Like if someone came into my house and said, you have to pick like just a couple sets of your activewear, and the rest has to go, like this would be one of the ones I would pick. Um, I think this is called the Sphinx. So there's like a keyhole here and a high neck. So I like that the other bra with the notch is like extremely different, totally different. Um, this one, I feel like obviously the keyhole um, fits differently on different people, but it can be like a little bit booby. So we'll see, we'll see how the notch does but I already know and love the Material Girl. Another fabric I already know and love is the Newbury. And I got myself some Lipstick Red. Lipstick Red came out in the Juicy Collection. I did not get any. I don't know if it was just that everything was selling so fast 
but I got some seamless stuff that didn't even work out. And I used one of my discounts from like my points. So I didn't end up returning them even though you could clearly see my bum because I wouldn't have got much back because I used a hundred dollar off coupon. So anyway, <laughs> I use this as my lipstick red redemption and I picked up the contour pocket legging and I love that these are Nubri. I have butter from the last launch in the last um, like capsule and it's just very, you have to be like super careful with it, which is fine. I don't mind having some leggings like that, but I don't want my whole collection to be like, you have to like be so careful. So I love that these are Nubri. Um, oh, hold on, let me show you the front. I'm sorry, I was showing you the back. This is the front, so you have these like contour lines that are supposed to kind of like snatch in your waist. Always love a snatched waist. They have pockets, like, above and beyond everything else it was the pockets that sold me that i was like these are the ones for me because not only is this red color absolutely beautiful i think it's the perfect red for like any skin tone but they have pockets the back you have the typical kind of v cut you have the contour lines coming up the back and then you have it's like a, a rubberized logo tone on tone which is great um these i don't think they have any type of scrunch or anything like it's just a normal seam up the back but usually buff bunny leggings do make your butt look pretty good even just like normally like they have good attention to detail so no pancake butt here and then this bra again i really wanted something different from something that i already have this is the empire sports bra and it is so pretty. They said it was like supposed to have Bridgerton vibes, which I don't watch Bridgerton, but look at this front. So the on the inside, you can see it's like pretty much just a normal V-neck, but over top, they have this like really beautiful overlay. Some people said they loved it and some people were like not so sure. And I was a little scared if I'm being honest, to go out on a limb. Um, but the other bra that they did in lipstick red is the Bloom bra. And please hold. I already have the Bloom bra from Off the Grid in red. It is a buffalo check, so different. But I was like, I don't want another red Bloom bra. And they barely ever do the Bloom. So I just thought it was so strange that they did the Bloom in the red for this collection but i don't know because i feel like it's not identical but like i could wear those together so basically now i have a couple options i also have from the off the grid the candy wrap as well so anyway <laughs> all that to say this is a different bra completely different from anything i already have it also crisscrosses in the back and it is a little bit adjustable. So I love that. I love when the straps are adjustable. I think that's so important because if you can adjust it, then like depending how long you are in the torso or even if you just want like a tiny bit more support, you can tighten it. So I think that's great. It also has removable cup pads. Um, I like that the thing for the removable cup pad is on the side. Some of their bras, it's like on the top. And I'm like, ooh, how would you even take that up? Well, you could take it out, but it'd be hard to get back in. So I'm excited. We need to try these, by the way. This is 1987 brand from Boston, of course. Um, Women-owned business. I love their stuff. Just want to shout them out. Um, hi, I am in love. I am in love. I put this on, I can't even. Um, the thing I said about the snatching, we snatching, like, <laughs> I looked in the mirror, I kept almost cheering up. It's an outfit. It's literally an outfit, but I love it. I almost need to take a moment. No, we're going to describe, we're going to describe how adorable this bra is. I love 
feminine, girly, like that is my favorite style. And this is it. This is absolutely it. I can't believe, I can't believe some people didn't like this. I love it. <laughs> like I put it on and it was so me the moment it hit my body. Um, so the back, sorry, we've got our tag. We're obviously ripping that right off because we're keeping her. Um, I love the little dainty straps in the back. I feel like this bra, like it's holding me in. I'm like medium size bust, like a, like a C probably for my size. I think it's not like anything giant. Um, we're not really having much of a cleavage moment, which I like, like, I don't like super booby bras. That's like not really my thing. So the ones that like the twist ones, I don't love those. I usually just buy them because I want the full set. So this is perfect. Perfect. I love the fabric. I love how it drapes like all the videos I was watching. People were like messing with it and like, oh, what if you pulled it down? And no, I think, I think it is completely perfect how it is. And let me just tell you, these leggings, these contour lines, they are doing what they're supposed to do. They are contouring. And then the back, we've got our signature buff bunny, kind of like a V going on. We're enhancing the glutes, but we're not enhancing the glutes. Like it's just right. And then like, if this outfit couldn't get any more perfect, then we have pockets. Like literally brought tears to my eyes how much I'm obsessed with this outfit. <laughs> and then we got a nice little seven eighth length, which I love. You can totally shimmy it down. I tend to shimmy it up because that's how I like it. Let's do a little squat test. I feel like because it's Newbery, I feel like it's going to be decently squat proof. Let's review. Yeah, so I'm wearing a nude thong underneath. Maybe if we're wearing like more brief style, you might see the lines, but I don't usually wear that. So up to you and up to you if that bothers you. But, oh my gosh, this way exceeded expectations. So glad I got this set. I was really tempted by the pleathery red and I was like, no, I'm gonna get something that I would actually really wear. And I'm so glad because I love this so much. The Material Girl outfit is not making me cry, but I do really like it. The notch front, I do feel like I am having a little bit of a cleavage moment there because of the notch. So, you know, that's not really my thing, but it's a cute detail. Actually, if I pull it up, I like, I kind of like it like that, like looking a little more long line, but then you sort of sacrifice a little coverage there. Um, yeah, I mean, I really like the material. Like I said before, I already have other leggings that I love by them in this material. Um, the cross waist, I feel like is hitting like a little lower waisted than I would like because of the dip down. Um, so I do, on me, I feel like I would be probably pulling these up a little bit in a workout. Like they just feel a little bit snugger somehow. Like, I don't know what it is. I do love the Venom color. I think it's so pretty, very fall-like, could take you into winter. I think it's really beautiful. I do like the back. The leggings, of course, have the V. The bra has the adjustable straps, little crisscross. It does feel very supportive though. So the you do have that going for you. It's really nice because I felt like, I don't know if it was the last launch, but like some of the launches lately, the bras have felt like they're not gonna be that supportive. And again, it's like those twist front, like very booby bras that I'm not that into. Whereas these two feel functional. I feel like 
even though, like I mentioned the cleavage moment, like I feel held in. I feel like I could easily like walk on a treadmill and I'm not gonna be out bouncing all over the place. Definitely amazing for strength workouts. Like both of these bras would be incredible. I mean, I almost, like I almost think I could jog. I'm not gonna go run a 5K in this, but I feel like I could do a little jog I could do a little bounce and we'd be okay. So, I mean, that's awesome. I think both of these are gonna provide pretty decent support if you're like medium or small bust, A-okay, medium, I think you'd be good. Large bust, then I think like having the more cleavage moment that me, then you might find more of a problem there. But, I mean, shout out to Buff Bunny. This was an amazing launch. There were so many pieces. I also wish I got the t-shirt, but I actually didn't even see it until I was already checked out. So <laughs> no worries on that. I spent enough money. We're good. Um, I will do my best to link the items, but sometimes they sell out. So I'm not sure what will still be there when this goes live. But thank you so much for supporting my channel. If you could just give me a little like and maybe a comment down below um, which of the two outfits do you like or have you tried Buff Bunny or what are some other brands that I should be trying because we're back baby. So thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video soon. Have a great day. Stay positive. Bye.